We have a special guest today. A star. A star, um, I guess. What is it called? Um, guest. Guest Jeff. EY. Alright, Ben. You wanna tell, want tell the world what's happening today? Yeah, we're making chicken tofu. And. Rice. Rice. Yes, okay, so we have Ichiban tofu, firm, and Jim Silver's chicken. We have, I think, the might the ratio of chicken to tofu is about one to one. All right. Okay, so we have our chicken here, and oh, okay, don't mix the chicken with tofu. It's frozen. Right? All natural chicken and not so natural. Okay. okay, so while the chicken is defrosting, we're gonna prepare tofu. So we slice through the translucent packaging. We can see where the tofu is not and slice up oh, all inside. <laughs> see, there's a lot of liquid. So be careful when you open it. And we'll just drain the the water. The tofu. Now the tofu is dry, we release it to the world. I think it's never seen the sun so pale. So now we'll cut the tofu into symmetric rectangles, boxes. Cut it, flip it on the side. Is there a specific technique you use, or like how do you know where to cut? Uh, you let the lines on the tofu guide you. There actually are lines on the tofu. You know, little. It's hard to see, but after you train a bit, after you cut several hundred pieces of tofu, you'll be able to see them. <laughs> Okay, so basically you cut the tofu pieces until they're about bite-sized. And they'll shrink a little bit after they go through the steamer. And I believe our chicken is done. Okay, so this, we'll put this into the pot first. I'll try to cut them the same size as the tofu. Now we'll... Lay them in the pot, and this takes some artistic skill here. We will, I'm gonna interlace the tofu and the chicken. Okay, now we need the green onions. So the green onions have cut themselves, and they're ready to go in the pot. And this will add green color. Oh, did you see the? So you see the chicken and the tofu is carefully interlaced, so that the flavor of the chicken will seep into the tofu as it cooks. Every piece of chicken is contact with another piece of tofu. Okay, and we have one more ingredient left, which is garlic. Alright, we're the garlic. So, most of you might already know this, but for garlic, you don't actually have to peel it. All you need to do, you can knife, crush it, and then the skin, very naturally, you just kind of rustle it around and the skin falls out. My finger needs to stop making a freaking appearance in these videos. Okay, let us check. It's been 15 minutes. 
Um, we'll see what the steamer has created. Don't blink. Whoa. I can't tell if it's done yet. I'm looking at it. Chicken. Chicken looks a little bit pink. Here. And the children say he could laugh and Let's give it five more minutes. Together or like? Okay, it's an additional seven minutes. And we're gonna check. Ah, you can barely distinguish the tofu from the chicken. They have blended together so well. Okay. Yeah. I think it's done. With a broomstick in his hand. Running here and there all around the square. Saying, catch me if you can. Okay, so here's what it is. I'm try this. And he only paused a moment when he heard him holler, stop. For Frosty the snowman had to hurry on his way But he waved goodbye saying don't you cry I'll be back again someday The garlic and the onion spices up the chicken really well Great Yes, I call it a success <laughs> It's all thanks to Beyonce's presence yes. <laughs> okay.